tilting down the camera completely checking the people on the street tilting the camera back up going backwards and oh that was a pretty good shot it's fun to them wow that was amazing did you see that bird good day and welcome today i will show you how i control the sticks and uh, how i hold the sticks and i'll be flying around and explaining what i'm doing and you will be able to see how i control the sticks and today we are also using an 800 millimeter lens to capture this part of uh, uh, market because very soon there will be um, a lot of changes here and we are capturing like the last breath of uh, the market as it is this is crazy look at the tower like the clock tower right there and uh and we are so close and today we're flying the dj mini 2 this is going to be kind of like constant flow kind of like cinematic flight tutorial kind of all in one video explaining things showing things so you can see how i am achieving these shots by the way we are using nd4 by freewell and if you want to get your own freewell nd filters link in the description so let's start with uh, capturing this part we'll do a slight rotation ascending shot with these with these buildings right here so beautiful scenery right here the central market you can get stuff here all right let's move on to the blip hangers historically these were blip hangers they were building building blips and uh, now now you can get food there how interesting how times change and buildings get used in different ways alrighty let's do a yeah just like that holding the sticks steady really the the thing which you need to master is locking the fingers in one position and then holding them very steady that way you will be getting very smooth very good shots just like this and always pay attention to the framing All right, let's check this building yeah i mean these buildings <laughs> okay losing the signal slightly we'll be going back so we don't lose the signal completely now let's fly with forwards motion slightly tilting up the camera and descending and checking out these people right here yeah slightly tilting up the camera beautiful always paying attention to the wires thankfully there are none here in this part and the birds the birds always do funky stuff in my shots like that some people ask if they should worry about birds and uh, what I am so <laughs> you, you shouldn't worry if you will worry then then you will attract those types of scenarios if you will be s chill about it if you'll just think that this is going to be a safe flight then birds will just do very cool things in your shots they will just fly through and uh, and uh, yeah they will liven up the shots just like they're doing right now all right so let's put the shutter 25 and now let's do a top-down shot going over these buildings
in this area. People are very interested in the big lens. <laughs> it's like a new world to them. It's like a new world for me. <laughs> yeah, Daniels is also very excited about this lens. Oh, there's actually quite windy up upstairs. Seems that, yeah, it's quite windy. So let's descend. Descend where it's not as windy and let's capture these these okay let's do it precisely right in the middle here yes and let's fly forwards capturing the beautiful scenery of the central market just like that wonderful just wonderful I wonder how this place will change in time. Okay, I could do it more precisely. I could do it a little bit lower also. Yes, just like that. Oh, that bird though. Cool. Now let's start a slight rotation with tilting up the camera. Checking out these tent type buildings. People sell stuff. People sell fruits and vegetables here. And if you're thinking, how am I not crashing into stuff? It's because I know the height. I know that over 30 to 35 meters, mostly everything is below that. So that's a safe altitude to be hanging out in. And if you want to get lower, then just fly forwards and see where you are going. Uh, that's simple. Yeah. Beautiful. Now let's do a rotation around here. People sending messages. Okay, let's check the blip hangers with a perfect, perfect rotation. And if only the signal. Yes. I need to reposition myself. Yes, right here. Oh, I know what I'm going to do. I'm going to fly through this gap here. Yes. We'll fly through the gap and we'll concentrate on the tower. On that big tower. Hopefully the signal will stay strong. Yes. Just how I thought. Oh, oh, whoa. I kind of did not mess it up. <laughs> and this is the old town of Riga, a beautiful, beautiful city inside of a city. If you ever come to Riga, I do recommend checking out the old town. It's the, like, if you come to Riga, you will definitely check the old town because like it's the main attraction here. But it's like, it's like a fairy tale town. It's so, so beautiful. It's so, so beautiful. Yes. All right, just like that. And now we shall start paying attention to the stuff that really matters today. That is this, this area. A good held rotation, really, all you got to do is hold the point you're rotating around very well. If you do that, then the rotation is well, well made. <laughs> all right, what else can we 
What else can we capture? Let's capture these. Let's capture these buildings. Yeah, it's beautiful. And the birds, birds, thank you birds for livening up the shots. Okay. It's beautiful. And now we shall do some sort of a forward sideways going into the forwards motion just like that closing down the camera checking the building tilting down the camera completely Checking the people on the street. Tilting the camera back up. Going backwards. And, oh, that was a pretty good shot. That was a pretty good shot. Well done, Rainis. Well done. All right, now let's come back here through here and let's fly a little bit lower so we can take in the views more detailed more detailed -y. all right slow slowly but surely moving in Oop. finger jitters <laughs> Uh, yes, yes. Oh, under the wires. And yes. Over the wires. Beautiful. Oh, here am I. Here am I. <laughs> oh, that was pretty cool. Check the tower if we are here. Let's check the tower with a backwards rotation motion. So rotating, slightly descending, tilting up the camera. And checking out the clock. Beautiful, beautiful. And now let's go and concentrate on the area this this empty place actually uh, not so long time ago there there were a lot of in this empty plats there were these tiny houses tiny buildings where people were selling stuff mostly contraband stuff <laughs> but now they all are gone because they will be building something else here and it might just be very soon now let's move into this white building descending altitude and rotating around just like that oh that's pretty cool whoa this was a well held move you gotta say I'm pretty happy about it. Yeah. Still well held move. Still holding it. Now we'll change the look at this building. Yes. 
And we'll capture some of these. Beautiful, beautiful. Wow. Did you see that? <laughs> well, if you're watching this video, you obviously saw that. <laughs> All right. And now let's do a, one more one more move around this area. Slowly but surely checking out checking out these things. People are very interested in the stuff we are doing right now. It's fun to them. Wow! That was amazing. Did you see that bird? That's what I'm telling telling you about. Like, if you will be chill, birds will know that you're chill, and they will just fly through your shots in epic ways, just like that. It's like, <laughs> oh, that was amazing. That was really amazing. All right. Yeah, Mavic Mini, I mean the DJ Mini 2 is really amazing. The signal strength is, is really good for this tiny piece of equipment. If you have an original Mavic Mini, I would definitely upgrade. I would definitely upgrade. Now let's move a little bit faster. Alrighty, hopefully this was what you were waiting for. Hopefully you were able to enjoy this video and maybe uh, maybe learn something new. Uh, how I control the sticks and how maybe you can control the sticks. I, I feel like this is, for me, this is the best way how to control the sticks because I have a lot of control over them. <laughs> and uh, yeah, so uh, thank you so much for watching. If you want to see more videos from me, then please subscribe. If you want to learn how to fly like that, uh, then go check out like playlists, I have cinematic flight tutorials, I have constant flow flights where you can just enjoy the views with one uninterrupted move like I was doing in some parts of this video. And uh, yeah, see you in the next video and may the force be with you.